in the shadowed valleys of ancient China, where the mountains whispered secrets of a time when gods and monsters roamed the earth. There existed a creature so fearsome that its very name was uttered in hushed tones, the Nyan. This monstrous beast, with its gaping maw and eyes like molten gold, lurked in the darkness, emerging on the eve of the Lunar New Year to spread terror among the villages. Legend has it that Nyan was unlike any creature known to mankind. It bore a mane of fire and had teeth that could crush bones into dust. Its roar could shake the heavens, and it had a hunger insatiable for fear and destruction. Each year, as the Lunar New Year approached, the villagers would live in a shadow of fear, for it was then that Nian would descend from its mountain lair to prey upon them. The beast's reign of terror continued unabated, year after year, until one New Year's Eve, when an old beggar wandered into one of the villages that Nian frequented. The villagers, consumed by their preparations to hide from the monster, paid him little heed, all except for an elderly woman who, moved by compassion, offered him shelter for the night. The beggar, who was no ordinary man but a sage possessing ancient knowledge, revealed to the woman the secret to ward off Nian. The creature feared the color red, loud noises and bright lights. That night, as Nyan approached, its heart filled with malice and its mind with thoughts of destruction. It was met not with silence and darkness, but with a blaze of red banners, the crackling of firecrackers and lanterns glowing fiercely in the night. Terrified, Neon recoiled. The monster, which had never known fear, found itself engulfed in panic. The red, which burned like fire, the explosions, which sounded like thunder, and the lights, which pierced the darkness, created a barrier it dared not cross. With a howl that echoed through the mountains, Nian turned and fled, never to return to the villages it had once terrorized. From that day forth, the people celebrated their deliverance from the monster's clutches with the annual festival of the Lunar New Year. They adorned their homes in red, set off firecrackers, and lit lanterns to remember the night they were saved from the Nian. The old beggar, who had vanished by morning, left behind a legacy that would transform fear into joy, despair into hope, and would bind the community together in a celebration that transcended time. And so the story of the Nian monster became a ghostly tale told during the Lunar New Year, a reminder of the ancient battle between man and monster, light and darkness, and the power of unity and tradition to conquer fear.